<laughs> that would never talk smack on a Chevy ever again. You might think pickup trucks are no match for a big tractor trailer, but one man likely would have been stranded if not for two strangers in a pickup truck. The rescue happened on Interstate 70 in downtown St. Louis, right at the height of this snowstorm. And tonight, that trucker is crediting these two good Samaritans for getting him home safe to his kids. Five on your side's Rico Bush. He is live downtown tonight. And Rico, these two, they just reunited with that trucker tonight. Yeah, that's exactly right, Jacob and Christina, and we see this time and time again during those major snowstorms. We often see those drivers get stranded on major highways like Interstate 70 that you see right behind me due to those dangerous conditions. But we also see ordinary people coming together to try to help those same stranded drivers. And last night, as you mentioned, one man, he sacrificed his time, his safety, and yes, even his pickup truck to help those drivers get home to their families. I think it's incredible when, you know, um, everybody in the same industry can come together and, and make things happen just to get everybody home. Now take another look at this crazy video on Interstate 70 near the Lumiere Hotel and Casino. A pickup truck pulled an 18 wheeler up the steep incline. Trucker Adam Bosler shot the video during the snowstorm. He says last night he was heading back to work when he got stuck going up an icy interstate. He says a good Samaritan then came over and used his small Chevy pickup truck to pull him to safety. He also says not only did that man help him, but he watched as he helped several other people as well. Earlier today, we caught up with him. He says he just wanted to lend a helping hand. I like to help people, and for that reason I did, just to open the roads as soon as possible and everybody to go home and safe. Now, that pickup driver told me he was uh, able to help drivers, four semi uh, drivers, of course, he pulled them to safety, and he says he would never think twice about doing it again if he ever needed to. That's the latest here from downtown St. Louis and at Enrico Bush. Follow your side. Mighty brave of him. Glad it worked out. Rico, live downtown. Thank you so much.